don't even do this shit for money, but they buying it in droves like it's half off. If Diggy got a show out there, you know he got a show out there. Girl on my arm, Russ on the farm, this the new guard. They put the boy on the jumbotron just to pump up the crowd. At my ten year reunion, like look at me now, having good sex on the rig. New type of beating my bed. All of my lawyers are black. Shit is ironic as hell, but I guess that what happened when you started rapping. Used to have turtles, no wonder I'm snapping. Used to commercial right, used to play Madden, no wonder they let me do both for a bag. I was not in a frat, I have never conformed to the 2000 cap. I never performed, I ain't taking no L. Fuck what you sell, I barely pay for my drinks, doing well. I tell them there's no need for the clips. I don't need sparklers, they know that I'm lit. I'm on top of the world. Fuck all these girls, I put my mama to play with my girls. I can tell all of you rappers and girls. Head hit the pillow and boom, it's tomorrow. But how can you sleep? 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 Last night was the town hall meeting. Apparently they didn't have a lot to talk about because it ended 20 minutes early. Uh, which is fine. That's cool. How's everyone doing? Everyone melting out here? Stupid, stupid hot out. Unreasonably, unquestionably hot outside. I've been super busy. Um, I see a lot of people going to football camp. It's got to be hot. I remember them days. Little League football. Uh... Things have been pretty quiet, I think. So, I guess there's been some break-ins, though. People walking around, getting in the cars and shit. And, and it's funny that they're getting caught on video. Because uh, I've never had a problem. No one's ever tried to get in my truck. But I, I blatantly have my <clears throat> ring doorbell facing my truck with a big blue light on it so people know that they're being video recorded. And, you know, I saw Rob Longcoy said something the other day about, um, uh, said something about he'd rather have his, his stuff stolen out of his car than his window broken. <laughs> Well, I mean, I'd, I'd rather not have either. So, but my, the way I've got my ring doorbell set up, it's always charging. You know, whenever I turn on, whenever Alexa turns on the porch lights, it also turns on the charger to my ring doorbell. So the big blue light is always on. Uh, and I'm pretty sure if Hazel heard a noise out front, she'd go fucking crazy anyway. <laughs> So that's just something to think about. If you need my help to charge your ring doorbell, then message me and I'll see where I can help. Uh, walking group has died out a little bit. Um, I went on vacation. Tony had an accident. Kelly hurt herself. Uh, Courtney was on vacation. But I'd really like to see it get back into gear. I want to go today, but I'm fucking, I'm exhausted. I got, I got a bunch of work to do today. Uh, somebody locals let me build some barn doors for her pool out back. That's pretty awesome. Whoop, whoop, whoop. You're fine. Like Star Oven News. Here we have Mr. Rob Longcoy. Good morning, everybody. You doing something special in town lately? What is it? Are you doing something special in town? I'm heading to Virginia. No, I'm not. I, is there something you want to promote on the news? Want, well, something I want to promote? You know what? Never mind. You <laughs> might not be smart enough to do this. Get involved in your community. Vote November 2nd. Let's be the change. Let's make a change. Vote for Longcoy. Vote for Tilly. Vote for Corbin's. Shawnee Corbin, not That's Corbin's. A, I, whatever. I'm, you know what I'm talking about. Fuck. 
That's what's hot in the oven. Pain in your Michael ass. Microsoft oven is. Alex, do you want to apologize to the community for being an asshole? No, I do not because I'm not an asshole. You apologize first and I'm a pain in your ass. <laughs> you are a pain in my ass. The biggest well, pain in my ass. Not and any, there's another pain in my ass. Obviously not anymore. Just apologize. For what? But just so that people don't take you the wrong way because people take you the I'm wrong not way. Even, I'm, I'm not even a part of your little clique anymore, so y'all have fun. <laughs> Have a nice day. She's jealous. She's <laughs> 61 degrees right now with a high of fucking 89 fucking degrees. 89. I said that clearly. Uh, it's going to be hot as shit all day. No rain. But it's going to... It should be cooling off by the fucking weekend though. That's cool. Good morning, Michael Starr of Anoogs coming at you. <clears throat> so, the very first thing I want to talk about today, um, I was watching the city council meeting last night, and then Becky Martin had said something about the Porter Johns, and then it struck me that I remember someone talking about how we just spent $75,000 on bathrooms at Mason Park. Um, my concern is why do we spend $75,000 on bathrooms at Mason Park and then have Porter Johns there? Well, it turns out uh, after some research that they built the bathrooms right next to to the city well. And we're not allowed to use those bathrooms because of the drainage and possible leakage into this city well. How come no one talks about this? That seems pretty fucking important. How do we remedy this situation? How do we fix it so that we can use those bathrooms at the park? Every time I went there, they were locked and I couldn't figure out why. And I found out last night. It's really upsetting. It's really upsetting. It's like this town just keeps taking these fucking shots. And then we think we're out of it. And then we get another shot. And then we get another shot. And then we get another shot. Which leads me into my next segment. Elections coming up, November. We got Bill Tilly. We got Rob Longcoy. We got Shawnee Corbin. I don't know Shawnee, uh, but from what I heard, she's she's young, but she's got a level head and she's smart. Hey, these are three good people. Uh, Bill came down to the Star Signature Shop and we talked for a little while, and it was nice. He's a good guy. I like him. I've always liked David, his son. Uh, they're good people. And they want what's best. Rob Blancoy wants what's best. Rob Blancoy is a smart dude. Don't say you want the change and don't be the change. Be the change. Make the change. Uh, I forgot to say, Macy Park, Food and Fleet. This coming weekend. Fortunately, I won't be there. Um... Motherfuckers out here thinking that their wives are sneaking over to my house and, and it turns out they're at the bar. Um, so instead of confrontation, I'm going to just keep my ass at home. So during the meeting last night, they said something about six animal complaints. Do oh, you think those animal complaints were all Tina? And if they're all Tina and the dummies, what can we do to help her get that remedy? She messaged me and I told her, I said, you know, it sucks. It really sucks. And everyone knows me, knows that I love animals. You might just have to put them dogs out on a farm. I mean, I'm, I'm going to go over and try and help again. I don't know how they're getting out. They're chewing through the fence. They're digging holes. It sucks. 
And, and everyone knows these dogs run around town. They see them. You know, they're not vicious dogs. But there was a lady commenting something about a Mastiff. And she's kind of got a point. Um, if dogs run up on Hazel, Hazel's going to do... Hazel's going to be protective. She's not... Now, she plays with dogs all the time. She plays with Murdoch, my buddy dog. She plays with Caleb, my neighbor's dog. She plays with other dogs all the time. But there's got to be an acclimation time, period. Um, and that's it. So if two random dogs run up on her. I don't have to say. You know, it sucks. It sucks. Mount Sterling, Mount Sterling football started. I don't see anything on the, the pages about that. When does school start? We need that information. Post it in the comments so everyone can see, please. Special Olympics. I didn't know that was coming up, and that's really awesome that it did. Uh, I want to say that I'm really proud of our community for that. That is so fucking cool to me that we would host an event like that. That is fucking neat, man. That is fucking neat, man. Okay. Kidding. Cool. Well, that's all I have today. Don't stop complaining. It's entertaining. See you next time.